Good morning, my loves. Good morning, good morning, good morning, good morning, good morning. It's a new day. It's weekend. Um, I obviously just uploaded a video, like, when was that? Yesterday? Um, on Friday. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, I wake up, I go ball, I go hard with my dogs. Bet it all, what's the call? Need a tan, never fall. Polo socks, polo jobs. Yeah, like I was saying, I definitely uploaded late, but at least I uploaded, right? At least I was able to stick to uploading a video for the week. Um, so today, um, I got up craving roasted fish like so badly. I wanted to eat roasted fish so bad. Um, if you're African, you know what I'm talking about, like roasted fish and plantains, or roasted fish and bubolo or mionda. But I don't have mionda or bubolo. So, nor bubble oil. So, I'm using plantains. So, I just, I literally was talking to my sister and I was like, oh my God, I feel like I want to eat this, but I don't know any African store around here or like Hispanic store where I can go get like, I don't know how to explain it, but like you go, they get the, you get the fish, they like clean the insides for you and all of that, right? So, I started like looking online and everything. I couldn't find anything. Then I was like, Tia, there's Instacart, there's Uber Eats, and there's Amazon Fresh. So I went on Instacart and I found this one random restaurant. Um, sorry, random um, market. Um, what is it called? I don't remember. Let me hold on. Let me look for what it's called. It's called. Honestly, I can't pronounce it. But I'll try to put it on the screen. Basically, all I'm trying to tell you guys is, is I actually found a store to buy fish. So I wanted some type of fish not tilapia but the only one they had was tilapia and i was like you know what tilapia will do <laughs> tilapia will do because i want to eat fish so bad so i went ahead and i ordered and my stuff just came <laughs> ah, but to eat fish <laughs> much better i don't know why i was struggling and holding the camera when i could literally just put the camera down and talk to you guys so for today i'm gonna cook make some fish Eat that, and then after that, I'm gonna go shower, um, and then right after that, um, I'm gonna get um, do my makeup, and then film uh, what's in my back video for Wednesday's upload for next week's upload, and then after I film that video, I see I'm trying to shoot two birds with one stone. Very exciting! I'm going to a Fire Boy um, concert tonight. Um, if you know, if you don't know Fire Boy, you know the princess at Peru. Para, Peru, Peru, para. <laughs> I'm gonna go see him tonight. Um, I don't think I even know a lot of his songs, but that one song alone is good enough for me. But I'm pretty sure I know his songs. I just didn't know he sang it. Um, but yeah, I'm super excited about that. So when I do my makeup, that's gonna serve for those two purposes, right? The video and um, the Fireboard concert, which starts at 7 p.m. And honestly, I'm so excited because like it's only like eight minutes away from me, six minutes away from my house. So that's beautiful. I don't have to stress. And we're probably gonna Uber. Um, yeah, we're probably gonna Uber there because I'm not driving six minutes away. Um, and then we're gonna go struggle and look for parking and stuff. So like, yeah. So six minutes away, we're gonna Uber. And then um, before that even, because that's at 7 p.m. So after I finish filming the video, what I have to do next is attend a class. So if you know me, you know I like shimani. You know I like to make money, and every and any way I can make money, <laughs> count me in. So I signed up for um, a certification class. I don't want to tell you guys too much about it yet until I'm done and everything, and you know, I got a job with it. Then I'll tell you guys and educate educate you guys on the process, and probably give you guys full information on who taught me, how to go about it, and all of that. But for now. Um, the next two months, I'm going to be a student. Um, I'm going to be learning um, a new skill and getting certified at the end. Um, so class starts today, right? Um, at what time does class start? Class starts today at 5 p.m. Eastern, which is 4 p.m. CST for me. Yeah. So 4 p.m. CST. And I'm running out of time because it's 1.22 it's 122 right now which means i don't have that much time i have to get to making this fish like like that so i'm probably gonna like spice up my fish everything put it in the oven to bake and then shower while it's baking um and then probably start getting my makeup done and like you know trying to do two things at the same time because i do have to film that video today and i do have to attend class 
and I do have to go to the concert. So my next three, four hours, is it three or four hours? No, my next from one to seven. No, from two to seven. That's two, three, four, five, six, seven, five hours. Yeah, my next five hours are gonna be very crunched and very uh, all over the place. Oh, I gotta do this, I gotta do that, I gotta do this. You get the point. So let me stop talking and jump right into like cooking so I can get that over with. And then, oh my God, guys, like I have so many beautiful apartment updates to show you guys, but I'm not gonna show you guys just yet. Um, I have like two or three things that are on their way to me. Not, no, that's a lot. I have a lot of stuff on their way to me. Um, and organization stuff as well. So I, I'm gonna do an organization video as well. Um, me organizing my pantry, um, me organizing the guest bathroom. All of that for y'all so i'm very excited about all these things that are about to happen i'm super excited <laughs> oh my god before i go can y'all at least appreciate my haircut can y'all appreciate this i realized i started looking so raggedy on camera and like it was beginning to become a problem because like how was i feeling so comfortable looking so raggedy on camera like my hair was just looking whatever um, cause it started growing a little too much and I think it was more so confusion cause I was at a point where I couldn't decide if I wanted to keep my hair long, if I wanted to like go braid it and like literally do the same thing on the sides, but then braid that middle section, right? That was longer. But when I thought about it, I was like, I need to start hitting the gym. I don't want nothing to be an excuse for why I'm not hitting the gym. Okay, let me show y'all. I even got like two workout, new workout, um, pants to make sure I hit the gym. Let me show y'all. I got some stuff. Let me show y'all what I got. All right, so these are the workout pants that I got. They're so cute. And the material is like so amazing. Um, but these are what I got. So cute. I don't like wearing like full pants to work out because I don't know what it is, but my thighs be itching. <laughs> so no, but yeah. These are, I like biker shorts to work out with. Um, and then I have like sports bras. I need more sports bras, but I do have some. Um, I have at least three or four that I can use in the meantime. Um, but yeah, so I'm about to start working out and I'm really excited about that. Um, I'm really gonna take it slow. I haven't been in the gym for two years. Ridiculous, yeah, ridiculous. Um, so I think I'm basically gonna, my point my goal right now is the whole of next week and the following week i'm just gonna be in the gym 30 minutes every day walking nothing else just walk right and then after um two weeks the next two weeks i'm gonna be walking for an hour each right each day um that's my plan so for one whole month i'm gonna be walking for 30 minutes um every day for two weeks and then one hour every day for another two weeks every day i don't they say, you know, start slow, blah, blah. I need to work out. <laughs> and I'm not doing much. I'm just literally walking. So I should be able to walk every single day. I mean, to be fair, I know there are probably days that I'm going to miss. No problem. But the goal here is at least five days a week, I should walk, right? I'm really going to make it a duty, my duty to do it every day. But yeah, anywho, that's the plan for the upcoming week. <laughs> or the upcoming month. Um... Or two months, I should say. So the next two months are going to be very serious. Um, I'm going to be eating healthier. I'm going to be, um, yeah, e literally eating healthier, except when I'm on vacation. Don't get me wrong. But, <laughs> I mean, even when I'm on vacation, I'm going to try to stay away from carbs in general on vacation. Probably just stick to meats and stuff like that. But other than that, guys, bottom line... We're gonna talk about this later, okay? My whole health journey, beginning and everything, we're gonna talk about it later. That's gonna be a whole nother video. But let's get to cooking. So, cause I don't have time for the rest of the day, so I need to get to cooking. So I'm gonna see y'all later.
is my eye doing that? <laughs> hey loves, um, how's everybody doing? Um, I'm done with class and class was great. It, it was very exciting. I'm definitely excited for this new venture. Um, it's actually 6.35, the concert is at 7. We agreed we were gonna leave at 7.45, at 6.45. It's 6.35, we're leaving at 6, it's 6.35, we have to leave at 6.45. So I have 10 minutes to finish getting ready. Fortunately for me, today was first day of class, so it was pretty chill. We didn't have to do much or whatever. So I took advantage of that and was doing my makeup while just listening, because more so introduction, you know, explaining like the skill and all that stuff. So I'm just gonna hurry up, try to do my lips, wear my clothes real quick. I don't even know what I'm wearing. I did not film the video that I was supposed to film. Time did not work out the way it was supposed to work out. So yeah, anywho, let's hurry up and get out of here. I don't know if you guys have noticed, but like literally, no, nude lipsticks are like my, my go-to. It's like the easiest thing for me. Um, let me see, I feel like the lighting might be doing. Oh, there we go. Yeah, all right. So like I was saying, I don't know if you guys have noticed, but I always wear nude lips. Nude lips are like my safe to, my, sorry, my safe go-to. Um, let me start dressing up real quick. <laughs> I'm ready, guys. I don't know how I did it, but I'm ready. Um, these are the shoes I'm gonna be using. Um, and this purse, let me dress it real quick. Hello. This is so funny. I thought I was recording. I wasn't. But either ways, I was telling you guys that I felt like I wanted to change my lips. Just because I felt like I would look better with red. And I think I like this better. And you know, red complements black a lot. So, let me show you guys my full fit. I'm ready. Um, how do I do this? I need you guys to see everything. Hopefully. Is that, do you see the floor? No. Now I'm too tall, so you might not see my face, but this is the outfit, Z outfit. Shoes, whoo. So yeah, that's what I look like. Let me turn the, the brightness up a little bit so you guys can see. Okay. There we go. Okay guys, this is what I look like. I'm such a baddie. See? Shoes. Shoes. My Burberry purse. <laughs> and I'm concert ready. Who this? Y'all know me? I don't think so. <laughs> Baby, I'm so excited. So yeah, um, off to this concert we go. I'm gonna be recording with my phone. Cause obviously, hold on. Obviously I'm gonna be recording with my phone cause I am not taking this camera with me. Why does my eye keep doing that? I don't know what's going on over here. That's weird. Anyways, um, I'm not taking my camera cause it's too bulky. It's a concert. So I'm gonna take my phone. Unfortunately, Tia, I can do better. I didn't charge my phone. While I was in class, my phone was not charging. And now I have a phone that is barely charged. But, yeah, anywho, I'm gonna see you guys in a little bit. Let me hurry up, because I know they are waiting for me, so let me Silica, 
Hey love, so I'm back from the concert. The concert was amazing. Fireboy is such a performer. Um, I enjoy the concert so much, like I can't even, oh my god, I can't. Um, it was so surprising because to be honest with you guys, I don't really know a lot of his songs. I just know Peru Para. But that's what I thought before going there. And when I got there, they, they, he actually had a good number of songs that I know and I thought that was kind of crazy but like in general he's like a very slow John Legend type of person but then he also does like some good like you know hype the video and all the rest type of songs so it's pretty interesting um and it was fun and then Ladipo came as well I was so excited he literally made my night but Fireboy is an amazing artist like Fireboy was hitting my heart I was like I didn't know I liked you. I think I kind of like you right now. Like, I really like him. Like, his perform, the way he performs, like, you feel his music. Like, I don't know how to explain to you guys, but, like, when he performs, you, it's like he's performing his music? That doesn't make sense. Hold on. You can feel the lyrics in his body movement, if that makes sense. Like, he feels the song. He sings it with his heart. And it was just amazing. I had a really great time. Um, I didn't think I was going to have as much fun as I had, but I really had a good time. And then there was a, this DJ called DJ Blast, but I think his Instagram name is OG Blast. Yo, he's an amazing DJ. Like, he is sick. What? So, he DJed so good to the point where, like, I felt we were already, like, yeah, we can go home now. And the concert had not even started. We were like, yeah, we can go home now. This is really good. We can go home now. Like, he played so good. Um, honestly, he deserves to be in some, like, African resort playing there and them paying him millions. In fact, he needs to be going worldwide, matter of fact. Like, he's so good. Um, yeah. And once again, DJ... Blast. His Instagram is OG Blast. Go follow him. I don't even know him. He don't know me. But I'm supporting him because he's amazing and he deserves the support. He deserves all the support ever. Like he's literally amazing. I'm not even fronting, but he's really amazing. Like everybody, like the entire club was jam. I said club. The entire venue was jamming. Like everybody to the point where you could have felt you could have almost felt like the artists were already there like Ladipo sorry um Fireboy and Ladipo you could have felt like they were already there but they were not because he was amazing um when he was DJing I was like if he DJs in a club I need to go to a party that he's DJing at because I feel like I will dance the minute I get into the minute, minute I leave because he's so good like sh chef kiss chef's kiss does that relate to this type of like does that does that like can i say that in this situation i don't know but yeah you get the point anywho so now that i'm back home um we're actually having game night uh in our game room so uh in a little bit i'm gonna be going downstairs we're having game night with a bunch of friends and then after that i think we're gonna go to the club so tonight's about to be a very very long night <laughs> okay really long night but yeah so i think we're just gonna do go do game night and then head to the club and i'm pretty sure the club is like after hours which is why we're having game night before going i don't really know i think i'm gonna need to take a nap because knowing me i'm not gonna hang you know if you guys if you know me hold on let me turn this down a little bit there we go so like I was like I was saying, if you know me, you know like I'm the I'm a party head. Like I can party from today till tomorrow. Not anymore though. That used to be me. I love it. Like I love partying. I still do. But to be honest, I just feel like I don't know. I'm tired of it. I guess that's all I can really say. I'm tired of partying because like. The vibe is truly not the same anymore. Like, I get tired when I get there. Like, I want to go to sleep. <laughs> I just feel like it's not my scene. I'm not, I don't want to say it's not my scene because I still love, like, the environment. But, honestly, if I had to pick things to do, I really wouldn't care about clubbing as much. Which kind of sucks. But, hey, it is what it is, right? I found other things that I like now as well, so... It's okay. Um, and I still party every now and then. Um, but I am excited to go to the club tonight because I haven't been out in a minute. So I'm excited to go out tonight and see what it got to give. 
see what a clip gotta give okay all right but anywho i will see you guys later um i'll probably bring you guys to the game night i don't know but i'll try to vlog a little bit while i'm there and then yeah i'm gonna see you guys at the club bye <laughs> Hey loves, I'm back from game night. Um, it was actually pretty fun and really nice. Oh, I don't know, I didn't tell you guys about my earring. Look at that. <laughs> I know this is so, literally so cute. And once again, this is from Icy Culture. Um, I'll link the earring in the description box and I'll put the Icy Culture on the screen. But yeah, my earrings from Icy Culture as well go shop um it's literally so unique so unique <laughs> but yeah um anywho the game night was really fun it was you know very interesting i realized i didn't record enough because i was having too much fun i low-key forgot to record but nevertheless i'm back home so i'm about to take off my makeup and head to bed it's been a long day today was really productive and long but today was a good day it was a day well spent um so i'm really happy about that but anyways i'm about to get ready for bed so good night y'all and i'm gonna see you guys tomorrow Mwah. Hello my loves, today's a different day. Today's tomorrow from when you lastly heard me say goodnight, I'll see y'all tomorrow. So today's, today's tomorrow, today's Sunday. Um, I'm so sorry I'm now just picking up the camera. As you can see, it's pretty dark out there. Today has been like a really long and busy day. Um, after game night last night, you know, I got back to the apartment at like 3 a.m. I was just ready to sleep and then I woke up this morning. I had to get up by 10 so I can get ready. I pretty much got up at 9 and I was just, you know, laying in bed and just dragging and dragging. Finally got off of my bed around 9.45, 10-ish. And then I went and shower and started getting ready. Um, so yeah, and um, I went to brunch. I went to like this um, Galentine's brunch. Ignore the color. So there was a color theme, right? And I absolutely did not see it. Um, or I should say I misunderstood it. So I went there. The only one dressed absolutely off. And the thing is I'm so mad because like I had an outfit that was supposed to make sense. Because it was white or cream. Which would have matched the theme because it was neutrals and purple. But tell me why I went ahead and wore, wore um, green and black. So obviously I was so off and I couldn't be part of the group. I didn't want to be um, part of the group picture because I felt like I was going to like mess up the theme picture, you know, because I'm really big on um, color schemes and all that stuff. And like for the organizer to take her time to plan out that event and then me go stand in there and ruin the picture like no. So I sat out. Um, but yeah, it was really fun. I got to meet some amazing ladies. Some of them that I, I mean, for the few ones that I talked to, I'm definitely meeting up with them again. Um, we're gonna like, you know, it was a very beautiful networking event. Um, I've definitely made some friends that are gonna be friends for a, a minute or a while. Um, I'm gonna be communicating with a lot of these girls quite often. So I'm pretty excited. Um, that was really nice. I'm back and then I just finished class. Um, I think I showed you guys a little bit 
or I'll put a little bit of a clip of it right now. But yeah, I was in class um, for two hours and class just ended. Um, so now, thank goodness I went out already. I'm already dressed and all of that. So we're supposed to be going to a lounge to hang out with some friends tonight. Um, actually, and like, what time is it? It's 6.38 p.m. So I should be stepping out. We should be leaving by like 7 um, to go to the lounge. So, yeah, that's what I'm about to be doing right now. I want to show you guys my outfit because my outfit was so cute, okay? I wonder what this is. I've been ordering so much stuff to the point where now... What? Don't tell me it's the things I got from Etsy. How did it get here so fast? Okay. I don't even know if I want to show you guys this because I want to do a video organizing my bathroom with me, my guest bathroom. So I don't know if I want to show you guys this yet. But I just ordered these from Etsy. I'll show you guys just one, okay? I know you guys obviously kind of want to see because I just unboxed it. So I'm going to unbox this one with you guys. Um, this is uh dispenser basically this one is for um dishes so um uh, dish soap let's go ahead open it up oh this is so cute i'm so happy i got this look at this so beautiful and it's porcelain it's so cute i love it oh my goodness this is so gorgeous. All right, let's go ahead and... Oh, I'm so happy. I'm literally so happy. Okay. Let's ugh, put dish soap in here. I'm literally out of my dish soap, which means it's time to go buy some dish soap. Oh, my God. Why is this so strong? Ugh. Okay. Hopefully this doesn't spill because I really don't want to have to use a funnel. Per oh, shoot. Right when I was about to be like, perfect. A little bit spilled. Ugh, I was talking too soon. Yay. Now my um, kitchen is going to look nice and clean because I feel like this little orange bottle just sitting there was looking a little messy. You know, <laughs> or orange liquid, not necessarily orange bottle, but just having orange liquid um, standing there. Guys, no, like on a serious note, how convenient is this? How freaking convenient is this? Now everything can just be nice and white like I want it to be. Because literally my apartment, if you're not white, you're not black, you're not wood or some type of nude, I don't want you. But now look at that. I'm just gonna go sit this on my um, sink. I'm not gonna show you guys my sink yet cause I don't have like my, my sponges are just sitting there. <laughs> cause I haven't found the perfect thing that I want to like sit my sponges in and sit this in as well. Cause I have to sit this, my sponges. I probably should get another one of these and call it one that says hands. So I know it's like hand soap and then dish soap. I probably should do that. Okay, so for the outfit, I want y'all to see my full fit. Bam, 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 bam. <laughs> see how good I look. I literally look so hot, huh? I'm looking hot. <laughs> and my cute ass purse, I love this purse so much. The Marc Jacobs tote bag, honestly, it's worth it. It's literally worth it and I have like a whole I'm about to do a video for you guys what's in my bag and I'm gonna be using this bag because I love it it's literally one of my favorite bags right now but yeah this is what you, this is what baby girl looking like <laughs> and my boots I don't know if I move backwards are you guys gonna see no hold on I feel like the lighting there we go why didn't I do that there we go now you guys should be able to see better, yeah? Let me tilt the camera. And look at this. Look at this. It's a baby girl. So that's what I look like. I'm about to go out and enjoy the rest of my night. 
Um, hopefully, I don't stay out too late. Let me see what time it is now. It's 7.20. So, hopefully, I should be back home by, like, 10.30. So, by 11.30, I'm in bed. Because <laughs> I got to sleep. Because I have a long week. This week is about to be so crazy. I have a long week. Um, so, I need to sleep. So, yeah. <laughs> I need to sleep. I need to sleep on time. Well, the truth is I usually go to bed early. Honestly, I've been doing such an amazing job since this year started, so I'm not even worried about that. But yeah, I need to... Um... I'm back. Um, and guess what? <laughs> I'm back. And just like I told you guys, I don't want to be out for too long. God is amazing. God listens to you. When you talk to God, he listens to you. Because look at the time. Uh, 9.46. Y'all see that? So, yay me. Now I'm just going to go wash off my makeup and go to sleep. Because like I told you guys, I have a long day. So if I can be sleeping by 10.30, this would be amazing. What time is it? 9.46. I don't think that's going to happen. It's probably going to be around 11 because I need to... Um, take off my makeup, shower, and I take too long to like get ready for bed. So, yeah, it's probably gonna take me a minute, but I'm just happy I'm back home. I don't know, like, I'm just happy. <laughs> so, yeah, I'm about to go shower and get ready for bed, and I'll see you guys tomorrow, okay? I'll probably bring you guys along with me tomorrow since like I have like a really busy day. Um, but I don't know yet, but we'll see how that plays out. Anywho, good night. Mwah.